Okay, let's get started here. Um, state whether the given sums are equal or unequal. So the i and the k, they're just dummy values, so they're equal. Um, this one here starts at 1, goes to 10. This one here, 6 minus 5 is 1. And uh, 16 minus 5 is 10, so that's equal. That's i squared minus i. And no, no, that's... Uh, oh, no, but actually, hang on. So that would begin at 1 times 0. And this one would begin at 1 times 0. And then this one moves on to 2 times 1. And then this one moves on to 2 times 1. Mm. And do they finish at the same place? 9 times 10. Yeah, they're equal as well. Uh, I squared minus I, and that take the K out, K minus, yeah, okay, they're all equal, they're all equal. Okay, this is 5 plus 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10, and this is 5 squared plus 6 squared plus 7 squared plus 8 squared plus 9 squared plus 10 squared. Use the rules for the sums of powers of integers to compute the sums. I, I don't know if that's saying to use the rules for aromatic and geometric progression, but that would seem mad to me because it's only going from 5 to 10. So it's just, yeah, I'd be mad to. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. That's forty-five. And five squared plus six squared plus seven squared plus eight squared plus nine squared plus ten squared. That's three five five. Now there are there are formulas you can use here. Like, for example, the sum of i, i being, could be 0 or 1, doesn't matter, to n. That's n over 2 times n plus 1. And there's one for i squared as well. Now, do I remember that? It's n over 6, 2n plus 1. Oh, now, now my memory's a bit rusty on this. It's been a few years since I used this formula. Um, N plus 1? No, no. I'm going to search for it now. Let's see what I get here. Let's see. <laughs> so... Oh, I'm right. N over 6, 2n plus 1, uh, n plus 1. So you could use these formulas too to help you, but that doesn't seem right given the this very small range of numbers here. So, yeah, okay. Let's, let's, let's see now. Let's check the answers okay let's do a few more uh, <laughs> Right. 
Okay, let's see. So sum from 1 to 100 is 15, 15, and 1 to 100 is minus 12. So, so this one here would be 15 minus 12, which is 3. This would be 15 plus 12, which is 27. The 3 and the 4 comes out, it's linear, so it would be 45 uh, plus 48. 93 uh, uh, 50 75 um, 40 okay let's see now okay up to seven. Five is twenty-seven. Seven is twenty-seven. Yep. Okay. One to seven on the next exercise we have to be gone.